it is the season. No, not that type of season, <laughs> it's planner season. And today I have the upcoming launch for EC. It's the Life Planner. I have the Daily Duel and the Inspire design, and I also have the horizontal canvas in the seven by nine to show you, and a ton of accessories, some which are brand new, so you wanna stick around Until for that. you look at me and see that I'm the type of girl you're not really that used to. Welcome back friends. If you're brand new to my channel, my name is Arlene with Arlene and Company. As I said before, the Erin Condren Life Planner launch is nearing, it's coming upon us, and it's time to show you some of the collection. Um, so thank you to Sam, Tori, and the EC team for sending a box my way in exchange for my honest review. I am so humble We're and excited gracious for it to come out and, and just see all the little pieces and, and you should see our town hall meetings because it, it's a riot. Anywho, um, I have the Daily Do in the Inspired by um, Etta V design and also the horizontal canvas. I just wanted to let you know because there's people that that are looking for a very specific layout and stuff that they want to see closer so just letting you know that and then my accessories it's mostly um I want to say it's mostly inspired is inspire um so by um Etta v. so um stick around for all of that i'm going to fit it all in the same video and hope you stick with me my friends okay um now if you are not an EC Insider member, the link is gonna be um, to sign up in the description box below. That's gonna give you the ability to shop a day early for launch day next week. And not only that, but also if you're new to Erin Condren, it's gonna give you $10 off your first purchase. So, hey, $10. So that is gonna be in the descri description box below. <laughs> I know what I'm saying, okay. Now you can get the life planner in this A5 size and let's just do a little comparison. I'm here, I'm here. Well, listen, you guys, um, two weeks post-op. This has taken me, I don't know how many takes because I keep jumbling up my words. I'm still very foggy, so I'm sorry. <laughs> um, hopefully, if you saw my last video, that was like right after, um, we can make this really fun. <laughs> I get loopy, you guys. All right, so here's the A5 size. This is the seven by nine size. This is like your traditional standard one. And then you also have the option of doing a ring agenda. This is last year design, um, the color blend, but um, I'll let whoever of the EC squad members I got the ring agenda go more in detail about that. But that is also an um, option with your inserts being A5. And this is the folio um, is a little bit bigger. So that is your ring agenda option. Um, and for coils, it comes standard with the platinum. This year, there's a multicolor option. I'll pop the picture up right here so you can see it. And that would look gorgeous if you choose like this um, Inspire design. Um, I think it'll look gorgeous, but I mean, you can bling it out with the canvas too. I think it'll look awesome with that too. Um, so you can do that. You can do rose gold, you can do gold. And I'm not sure if black is going to be an option. That'd be interesting to see if they were going to bring that back. Um, but I know black is an option in the notebooks and the teacher planner. Um, still, hopefully, I don't know. We'll see. Um, so, and then also you have the Inspire. This is the canvas, which is the neutral. This is like your uh, your colorful one. And then there's also wildflower, which is very, very beautiful. I almost went with wildflower and then I changed my mind last minute of which one I wanted to go ahead and review for you guys. Um, and then this is the focus collection, which is in a league of its own. All right, so let's start with your standard friend right here um, and do the seven by nine horizontal layout. Layouts. Now you can have the vertical, horizontal, hourly, and the daily duo, which is the A5 that I have. Um, and the daily duo, which is your daily layout, can come in A5 or your seven by nine. Now, if you want to, let's see another layout really quick. So you say, oh, what's the difference between horizontal and vertical? This is, this is for my Black History Month collection. Isn't it gorgeous? I love it. Um, this is your vertical. Now, this is not this year's design. This is the color blend, which I love. I love the color blend. Um, but anyway, this is the on the vertical with the three boxes and then some lines on here. Um, horizontal has lines in the box, and I'll show you that in a second. And that was my designing factor. I need lines, friends. I really do need lines. I hope that one day um, they put lines on the uh, 
vertical layout. So what do you think? What do you think? All right, it comes with a uh, standard, um, universal standard ruler. So you can put this on any of your size um, planner. So as you can see with the A5, it's the same size. So they may be standard. I think it was like last year, maybe. Um, a lot of their snap-ins can go pretty much on any side. So that's really fun. Um, the covers are interchangeable. Again, if you're an EC fan, you already know all this. Just put me on two times speed and just speed me up, all right? But just in case anyone that's not familiar with it, we're gonna go through the basics. These snap in and out. I'm in like a weird position because I have to be like extra comfy to do this. So, but normally you just snap in and out and any cover you like, like you just saw, I had like a Black History Month collection cover and stuff. I have like, I don't know, like 30 different covers. This dashboard is different than what it was once upon a time. Is this subject? Okay, so the dashboards used to be like this big open space here. Um, and this is like an 8 5 This was another Black History Month collection. You guys like, oh wait, come on, show us this collection. But I just wanted to show you the difference. So now you have like these dedicated boxes, but they're not let um, label. I would suggest using wet erase on here. So, you know, just this doesn't smear or anything, but you can do that. Or if you just like to like stick post-its, that's me um i don't write on my dashboard don't ask me why it's there but i don't know here is the vellum with the canvas i think it's very very beautiful i like to um, stick um like supernatural stickers and stuff like that on there um i'm a supernatural stuff and i just kind of dark it out now the the canvas is perfect um it's a clean slate so it's perfect for folks that just like to bring their own design into it and their own color and don't want anything hindering um, um, that whatever sticker sheets and whatever you have your functional on? planner and you just like a, you know, just a very nice clean slate. This is it. Um, this is, again, I think it's just so like beautifully understated but like you know it's just nicely done i don't know i really appreciate this um spread what do you guys think a beautiful day begins with a positive mindset i like a clean slate but then i at the same time sometimes i'm feeling kind of loud and i want all the colors and everything else so i was really excited to do this again so you have a two page um spread from going from um july 2023 to 20 um uh, december 2024 now options again you can get a 12 month or an 18 month planner this is 18 months so as you can see is a big boy all right stick i love that it's an 18 month i don't know who sticks with the same planner for 18 months though i always like you know i, I get a lot of 18 month planner but then you get that itch you need something else now these boxes these 12 boxes you can use it all kinds of ways so whether it's for goals whether it's for maybe um something you want to focus on each month or whatever it may be maybe you have some um habits you want to do whatever it is have enough courage to start and enough heart to finish i love that anyway so you can decide whatever you want these um the spread to be so that's gonna be you know and the life planner all these like beginning pages and all that stuff is gonna look the same so what's gonna change is your uh, weekly pages and obviously the design is gonna be looking different depending on that so you have a note page after that i really I don't know i'm so i'm super in love like i i lean more towards color but then i get into these moods that i really just want um it's just beautiful neutral layout and i i think this neutral like hit it out of the park for me um not the neutral doesn't always catch progress me. each day adds up so you have the uh, month tabs and let's take a look at those because the neutral design did not have the gray tabs. They had like the floor one, um, not the floor, but you know what I mean. And they had like these pastels colors and I know there was a lot of feedback and they listen um, about bringing this back. So I love the gray. I love it once upon a time when it was black. I wanna say they, they had the black tabs in the past too. Um, but gray is a happy medium Two page spread for your monthly spread. You have some pre-printed holidays on here. Um, so you can see 
and you have the heritage ones that is uh, you know whatever is um, important to you that you can go ahead and add i'll show you that side profile right here with um for notes or to do's or maybe just like you know a knockoff sheet for the month whatever you need to do you have this big open space so those of you that use sticker kits i don't but you know you have the space there this color blend but um this little asterisk i want to maybe they did this in the past i'm not sure but that's a that's a little different so uh we'll pay attention to daily do and see if that's carry through so it's a clean slate it's a clean slate you have the 80 pound mohawk paper this stuff takes everything i mean i i have not met something that has done poorly on easy paper so if you are a paper snob like me have a field you know what and if you want to start slow you're not ready to commit to a planner get a notebook because it has the same paper um if you get the coil notebooks it has the same paper as the planner so you can really have some fun with it test it out with all your pens that you like to use and get a feel for it all right so here you have again the blank um, page that you can do whatever you like and then your monthly dashboard so let's see if you can pick this up on the camera there you go has those little asterisks right behind the July so it's just very very like you know um, just gentle there in the in opaque in the background and then again you have the open boxes that you decide what you want to do with this so whether maybe you want to pass a meal some some tasks that you like to do some habits here some quotes um, I do like how Erin Condren and this is, goes across with like their teacher planners and things like that they allow you to decide hey this is what I want to use it for without having everything like pre-labeled and to me that's like really big because I don't like to be told what to do <laughs> All right, so then you go right into your weekly layout. So this is what a horizontal layout looks like. So it is lined, and then you have a box here, which you can stick some of their stickers on there um, that they fit will fit perfectly on here. The holidays are um, pre-printed on your weekly layout as well. Very small, so they're not in the way. Um, and you still do have the mini month in your week. Um, and I know that is a point of controversy, especially for the daily um, layout, like if people want it there or not. Um, but it's still here on there. So I'll show you in a bit um, with the daily duo. But it is on the weekly layout is the, the month. Um, I don't think I ever do anything with it, if we're being perfectly honest. Uh, but I don't mind it there it doesn't bug me it doesn't bug me all right so then you end with a note page so what i can say is about the life planner is you have a lot of note pages in between the months and then you'll see at the end as well so this really can be an awesome workhorse and an all-in-one planner so whether you're someone that needs to plan by the hour you can get the hourly someone that needs to compartmentalize their day and do the vertical the three boxes i used to be a vertical person but i really need lines um, and or so when they need to plan day by day so you still get like all the goodies from having um, the life planner but then you have a daily um, layout all right so then again you go into your next month so let's take a look at these tabs really quick um, just so you can see the different quotes um, and again this is an 18 month so let's play some music to the last month you'll have two um note pages because your divider page here instead of having um uh, an art you still have a note page so this tab is for notes and then you have some line pages on here and have a few of these so here is the heritage and awareness and um services and it has the 2023 and then 2024 on here for you so then you can decide um, which ones you want to highlight or which ones are you know most important to you 
Then you have let's keep in touch. So name and then whatever contact stuff. Maybe you just want to put their emails and stuff. I don't think anybody really puts phone numbers anymore, but maybe, maybe. But like, you know, email contacts or business contacts or things like that, you can go ahead and do that. Then you have your look ahead, as what I like to call it. And you have January 2025th, um, 2025th, 2025 whoa through um december of 2025 on this one so um it'll just look on the year further again this planner ends in december of 2024 so obviously this check out the stickers in the canvas design so it's not like um i i prefer these a lot more than the other one that was kind of just like universal kind of gold foil and stuff like that I really like these because it has a pop of color and it just doesn't you know it's still neutral to me but it has a pop of color you have like some you know functional ones uh, today this week um, you know and then some little habit circles throughout and there's something in the hourly um, planner that's going to make a lot of you happy. So I'm going to pop a picture right there if you choose that option. So take a look at that. Then you have some celebration ones, a list party, happy birthday, celebrate. Then some have a two-sided pocket. So on here with your welcome kit, you're going to get some... Uh, these cards that you know it's just like compliment cards if the future is bright you're wonderful just as you are and I just love this little touch that has been in the life planner for quite some time now um, then you have a discount card um, that comes with it and just a little welcome thing this has some okay coupon. and then you have the perpetual calendar that comes with your life planner I have a collection of these at this point. <laughs> All right, so this, you know, you can just bring it in uh, from year to year and not have to redo this, but it comes with each one of your life planners. It's the perpetual calendar and contacts, keeps track of dates that you celebrate year after year. And it just has them by the month on here. And you just, you know, want to stick everybody's birthday. So when you're setting up your planner, everything is pre-done for you. And then you have holidays and dates right on there. Um, important contacts, important passwords. So this simple little book until let's say, you know, like, you know, it's time for a new one just because um, you can put, bring this in from planner to planner with you as you set it up, especially those that have multiple planners is super helpful. Um, and then you, again, you have your black um, back dashboard, which is lined um, and the end of your planner. So let's take a look at the daily duo. All right, so daily duo time. Um, why is it called that? Okay, so we have two books, six months in each one. So when you buy the Daily Duo, you're going to get two books, okay? So two identical books, just obviously one is going to be six months and then the six months after that. You can get it coil. You can get it in a ring agenda. Again, this is last year's design, so I'll let my fellow EC Squad members show you this year's. Um, but this year is going to have, just a note, it's going to have the most options for inserts. If you want to really customize the heck out of this, you can um, really make it your own. Um, even, this is like homeschool friends out there, if you decide that this is something that you would like because it's nice and compact or whatever for homeschool, there's even like checklists and stuff like that that you can do an insert in a ring agenda. So you can do the daily deal in a ring, you can do it in an A5, and you can do it in a seven by nine. I feel like a children's story right now. So just so you can see a visual of the difference. So A5, seven by nine. All right. Um, I like for a daily planner to be as small as possible, but I know everyone is not like that, um, but that's my thing. Um, so let's take a look at this. You're gonna get two identical books. You can customize the cover on, uh, on the first one and then the second one is gonna have like the design one uh, for the year. You get a ruler on each of your books so you don't have to worry about like losing it with the first one or that you're not gonna have it or whatever not. I'll tell you these rulers, I've had like this, even my first one that I don't know how many years it is now and it looks almost new still. Um, they, they're thick, they're like, they last quite a bit. All right, and they've gone through an evolution of different um, design changes. I love looking back at that. It's kind of just like the frosted stuff. All right, so this is Inspire Design. And 
and uh, again these covers are interchangeable so you can buy whatever um cover you desire but then you can buy some extra ones to just like switch it up the vellum y'all the vellum you can also upgrade the coil so this is an upgraded coil on this because it's gold it comes with platinum the life planner you're gonna see some familiarities with the beginning pages um the tabs are quite different on this one friends you have the colorful type of six tab. boxes here versus the 12 because there's only six months in this book so when you keep in mind the layouts that you're going to see here it's only this 2023 right. on this side with some space here to write any notes or anything that you want to highlight and then 2024 on the next side okay you have the covers, I want to say, because of the mohawk, the 80-pound mohawk paper, and these dividers, like, there's grit to the EC paper. There's a grit, there's, you know, and that grit, you want that grit, friends. The pen's just, like, says hello. All right, so you want that grit. Um, but the way that this design from Edavim, it it looks like a paint. Like, it's hard to really describe in person. Like, I don't, I mean, in all, over on a camera, I don't think you can really appreciate it off from a video or a picture. But in person, it looks like a canvas um, painting. I hope that makes sense. But it looks like it. Like, you can see the texture um, in it. So, I thought that was pretty cool as, you know, our artist family here. Um, I thought that was pretty cool. That that's money to me I love that so I thought I really knew what I was going to do um, I was planning on gifting the daily duo um, just because I, I saw myself more in that um, horizontal and after getting this like I'm very like I don't know I don't know which one I, I want to do so what I do is like planners that I decide like when I review something and I decide okay I'm not I'm not gonna use this and just let it sit on my shelf so I find someone that you know will feel like all excited about getting in and stuff like that and usually it's like a classroom teacher or some sort and you know for their life planner and then something for teacher planners or whatever that's just my little thing anyway so you have a two-page spread just like um on the other one it's just a smaller scale obviously because this is an a5 holidays are printed on here then the note sections on here so you can imagine this the same with a seven by nine just larger um but that's really pretty again you can really see the texture like you can see the texture i thought that was pretty cool um, then the note page, the dashboard, this is how the dashboard looks Colorful design. It. The wallflower, it'd be interesting to see how that dashboard looks. Um, but that's, you know, the difference there. See okay. this colors um, carry through, so just pay attention to that. Here is your daily setup. So you have two different months here, that's why you're starting here with green here. Let me not upset your eyes, okay? Um, <laughs> let's start here. Okay. Is that better? That's better. Yeah. I, I know my, my friends that are well, probably getting a twitch. So the monthly is still in your daily, um, in your daily deal that, um, then little mark there. I know some people just cover it up with a sticker. Some people use it. So as of now, it's still there. All right. So your daily layouts are from 6 a.m. to 7 p.m. with a half um, hour marks. As you can see. It's just like little dashes on here. Kind of reminds me of like those elementary um, notebook pages. So you're like practicing lettering and, and, and cursive and stuff like that. But, um, and I know this is like the typical way to do like the half hour marks. For me personally, I think this is a very functional design. For me personally, I, I don't know about the half hour mark. I know that a lot of people use it. I need half hours um, too, but somehow I just like write like 8.30 or something like that. I, I'm i not a fan of the line here just because it reminds me of grade level notebooks or something. It's a me thing. Um, I'm just not a fan of those lines. Um, and I know some people just live by this layout. And it's just totally a visual thing for me. Um, but other than that, I I will say this is a very functional planner. I did the Daily Duo and a Ring Agenda before, and it really does help you keep on track. So you have a to-do um, here off to the right, and then a space here 
uh, which I tended to use for a quote or just like, you know, some stickers or stuff like that. Then you have off to the side here, if there's a holiday and a day um, printed on here. And I'm thinking the wildflowers most likely will have a different font. So I'll be interested in seeing all that a little closer from the other EC squad members. Um, again, so that carries through. So where it changes this is really cool because when the Daily Duel first came out, that's this wasn't like that. You have Sunday and then you have a blank note page. So I think this is cool for like meal planning or, you know, planning ahead, things like that, or just all kinds of things before you hit into your next week. So your Monday always is on your left and then you continue on. Again, this is a really nice and beautiful planner. I had full intentions that I was going to use this one that came in the box um, for work. And um, I was going to, to gift this forward to someone I knew that absolutely loves um, and can use this. Like, I want to make sure it goes to someone like you can use it. But it's so gorgeous. Like, I don't know. And I do use a daily planner. I need a daily planner. My only thing is this minor little thing is those little dash lines that I don't know why they bug me, but they do. Like the monthly um thing on here bugs so many people and it doesn't bug me at all. So the, my hang up is <laughs> stupid little lines. I don't know why I'm like this, but I am. All right, so that's how it is. And then you go through the whole month and then it ends in a note page, right? Um, Or depending where you're at, right? So you have, because it ended the month on a Sunday, um, you have two note pages or from side to side. So it's gonna depend that we'll see in a little bit. Again, you can really see the textures. Like, I I don't know, like it, it, you can really see it. So let's take a look, a little music, please. <laughs> this stuff right there, um, just so you know, this is gonna match the monthly. So on each one, the divider matches the monthly, all right? So that's really beautiful. I think I love that. You know, I'm not even a purple person. I think that's really pretty. Um, so at the end, with this one ends in December, you're going to have your last page of your spread and then two pages of notes on here. So you're not, because this is a daily, you're not going to have like an extra daily, um, you know, note tab on there, but you have all the, the notes in between each um, week. So that's more than enough, I think, well, for most people. All right, so the stickers here um, you receive with the Inspire collection is pretty, all right? That's pretty. So they have like the functionals important this week to do. And look at this folder. <laughs> this is my hang up. Like, I don't know. What do you guys think I should use? This daily duo or the horizontal? Or should I just like, you know, use them both or use them both? I don't know. And then I end up using everything. Who knows? Uh, but it's two sided. You have the pockets and um, the back of this planner. So let's just take a look Next at the one, just so you can see. And then it's the same thing. You get that, you get the um, January to June of 2024, the vellum, everything is on here. And then you start. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I didn't even notice this part because I was just like so busy with the first six month book. This is my favorite color right here, like that kind of Tiffany blue um, deal. And that's my birthday month. How perfect is that? Maybe this is a sign that I should use the daily duo and get over the half hour mark line. I don't know, Is am I alone in that? Am I, I don't know why it bothers me so much. I love this color too. That's so pretty. Anyway, so just so, just you, so you can get look at the interior design. And this one also comes with your two discount cards and the compliment cards and things like that too. So that's in there. And you have the perpetual calendar that I show you from before also comes in the daily duel. All right, let's take a look at some accessories. This is the Etta V Inspire washi tape. I don't want to unwrap it because I have so many washi tapes that are so full and I like to keep this wrapped for when I'm ready for it. But then, I don't know, I really want to use this one. So this is one of the Inspire ones. Let's keep you there. This makes a beautiful gift. Um, I already played with it, I wrote with it. Um, <laughs> 
I did all kinds of stuff. This makes a beautiful gift. Just, you know, like, look at the presentation. Woohoo! I'm pretty. All right. So this pen is everything. All right. So this comes in that Edivy design for this year. And it has, like, that rose gold tip. You're so pretty. Let's get This was from the warehouse sale, this notebook. I love it. Use it to, like, dump plans my other stuff but oh and it just like glides on that paper oh that looks that feels nice that feels nice you know how like certain pens just feel nice writing on it that feels really nice all right so the notebooks remember the notebooks have the same type of paper as the planner oh that's so pretty dude that's really nice I'm really excited about that oh, my back is killing me I need to like stretch and come back this is gonna be a second these um i put everything back in their plastic so i would remember the names of how it appears on the site for you guys um and then you can bookmark the life planner um page and then i'll bookmark my affiliate link which i appreciate this is the magnetic to-do list dashboard i have these pretty much in all my plans it's, can you see the thickness it's super thick so you have Monday through Sunday on one side. Again, you can use like a, one of their what um you know wet erase markers on there. Priorities and to do. And this puppy, like you can grab some pages, y'all. You can grab some pages. It's super thick. It's like that magnet is strong. I'm shaking it. All right, that magnet is strong. So, anyways, fire. Like, that. let's say you really love the stickers in your life planner and you absolutely need more. I kind of tend to forget that I have those stickers and then I'm like, dang it. And then I have to like rip them out um, at the end and then I have like a stack of stickers. But these are like the extra ones that you can get. So this is from the Life Planners. Priority stickers, 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 stickers. So you can get extra ones, so that's cool. Um, then, oh, I was so excited about this. Look at these. <laughs> oh, you guys should see my collection of Erin Condren pens and markers. This is writing tools and variety packs, six dual tip markers, and six chisel tip highlighters. Say what now? So you have fine and medium tip, cherry, hot pink, orchid, sea foam, highlighters. Let's try a towel because it's a twirler one. And hello. I probably should have picked a darker one <laughs> to do this, but hello. Um, it's you know the EC markers, so they're the nice, the nice, and then here's the highlighter. But the covers are different, you know, with the to match your planner design because you know if you are a planner nerd, you're matching your stuff to everything, right? That's just how it goes. You know, don't don't try to pretend that you, you're not. And I put that in the wrong slot. That's going to bug me. All right. I'll fix that. Usually I have, like, notes off screen, but I couldn't do all that, friends. I couldn't. Like, this is a lot of energy. So you know the accordions, which you see in my teacher cart all the time. This is a canvas accordion. Three large pockets. And I have so many ideas for this. And you can get the customized one, like some with the initials and stuff. I love this so much. <laughs> like, I, okay, okay, let's imagine here. All right, so let's say you have like a toddler or stuff and you need like, um, you know, those busy things that you put. Like I always had um, like crayons and different things and different like safe toys and stuff that wasn't messy or that's not gonna go rolling away in the restaurant, um, you know, or different like puzzle stuff that you, they can stay busy for. All right, so let's get from toddler years. Let's say you want this for your makeup or, you know, your skincare routine. Oh, possibly. Maybe you're a teacher. You want all your essential supplies. and So it's not only for planner thing. That's what I want to get at. You can use this for everything. It has the Edivy design for Inspire. And I love this thing. I don't know why, but this is probably my favorite item. Probably. Maybe. I don't know. Just bask in it because it's awesome. And it comes in several designs. There's several of these. So I can't tell you how much I love this. All right, let's move on. This was a surprise. This item is brand spanking new and it's everything, absolutely everything. I love it so much. It comes for the seven by nine 
and in the teacher planner like um, size of um, the larger one. So eight and a half by 11 or eight by, yeah, I wanna say. <laughs> I'm trying to remember exact dimensions on the teacher planner. These are snap in pocket dashboards. So not only are there dashboards, it's a freaking pocket. Friend. So excited about these. This is gonna be around $10 for a set of three. I think that's pretty freaking rad. I tend not to, I know a lot of um, other of the influencers share prices and stuff like that, but I don't, you know, if anything changes or stuff like that, their link is gonna be there. But if you get an um, idea, the, their accessories are very reasonable and they always have that those sales. I don't wanna say always, but they usually, if you get four accessories or more, you, you get a discount. So it really is pretty rad. Uh, but this is also gonna come in the teacher planner size game changer i freaking love this i love this so much okay I'm, I'm, I'm done i'm done i'm fine i'm fine i'm okay i'm okay all right the next one i have is the inspire sticker book by edavib dude look at it look at it okay look at it look how it opens like it even has its own thing right look how it opens this is beautiful. It has those rose gold touches to it. It has these boxes that will fit on, you know, this little, like, especially a horizontal one, but vertical planner, your, all your little designs. So this is your Edavie sticker book. If you want to grab one of these, um, again, I love this, the moon shape ones. That's so pretty. Oh That's so pretty. Okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. All right, friends, I know, and you guys know I'm a petite planner user. I, this was a nice surprise because we have, what have we not seen in the website for a bit? The monthly planner, right? It's an Edavie monthly planner. And if you, I used to use this, I was a Hebrew school teacher uh, with the little ones. So I had the preschool class and this is what I used. Um, I had a little extra notebook and stuff with a couple days a week and stuff, so it wasn't something I needed a whole teacher planner for, but I use this monthly planner. And this is what it is. It's the monthly spread with some notes in the back. Gorgeous. Frigging gorgeous. <laughs> um, so, you know, the months continue on like this, and you have it to all the way yeah this is i want to say 18 months yeah 18 months monthly plan, um planner as well so this is your monthly and then you have the note pages all these line pages at the end friends with a pocket and some stickers and this can go in one of your ec um, folios on the go in one of your books um i'm using another cover right now um and you guys know i have like all the covers all the covers um or you can just put in a sleeve or whatever or just use it on its own if you want to so this is awesome that's many i'm not going to take these out because i have like a hundred of these out and i use them on everything including my kiddos curriculum that are coiled and this is how i bookmark it i use erin condren snap in mini bookmarks so this is the um the Edavie collection. Then you have one. this universal snap-in. So this is the nice thing about their snap-ins is that you'll see they'll say universal. I mean, if it's on the clearance, just um, pay attention to see if it's actually um, one of the older ones that are not universal. But this is again like um, a divider that you can use as a dashboard, and it has this the same as the the magnetic thing. So priorities to do Monday through Sunday, um, and that's that universal dash-in. This thing is freaking gorgeous. Next one. This is the ultimate planning pack. Pack your accessories. Normally it's like, it looks like that very stretchy thing, but it's still like pretty, but this looks almost like satin. It's freaking gorgeous. I use one um, and I like slide in my Hobonichi Weeks in it, y'all, um, which is rad. So this fits right over here and it also fits your seven by nine. I'm kind of off to the side, not in my normal like desk setup and stuff. So don't mind me if I'm a little awkward. So you can put this in here. You can put like your markers and things like that. And um, let me show you. 
opens here you have a pocket look at that it's just so pretty but and then you can hang some pens some i like to put these extra bookie marks in sticker here. sheets whatever you like on it these are the ultimate planning pack you can really pack these up too it'll still close <laughs> that um anyways they're pretty too and you want to see how it fits on a seven by nine and how it pairs let's do a little style like that that oh my goodness all right i love that i love that look how they look if you're gifting someone something all right let's put this Jeez, look, look, look. Oh, look at that. That looks so pretty. Oh my gosh. I think I've I think I want to do that blank canvas uh, for my work planner and accessorize it with Edavi. I think that's where I'm at. What do you guys think? I love that. Okay. This is what has me puzzled if I should start um if I should do this is the A5 slate blue and it is one of their brand, brand new planner zip folio. So these are I have like all the planner folios, right? but this has this is the other one that this is in a bigger size I had in school. This is what we had before. I'm not sure if this style will still, like, you know, if this is going away or anything. I don't think so. I mean, there's still there are a lot of them, but there is this option now. Um, so it'll be interesting to see where they're heading. Obviously, this is, like, heavy duty. Um, and this is works really, really well. So this, and this is obviously, like, an improvement with that. So obviously there's where you can see the difference. This is just like a soft, I don't know why I just put it back when I need it again. This feels more like that laptop covers, um, folios. So, and I actually use, um, one of those regular, um, EC folios for my MacBook. This is gorgeousness. We can say it. Go ahead and say it. It's it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Like, check it. So you have a match pocket here. You have another pocket here. You have, like, another pocket here. You have pen loops here. Like, shut up and take my money. And I can't wait to see all the designs this comes in because, for real, like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? All right, so let's see because this is for the April. Oh. Dang it, I don't know what I want anymore again. You slide that puppy in. Decorate however you like. I, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. This is so hard. This is so hard. I don't know what to do with my life. Oh, yes. First world problems. Okay, so you have that. Let's stick a highlighter in there. I mean... Where's my bookmarks? Let's 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 put some bookmarks. Okay, we're not taking out of the package because I'm just not living that life right now. <laughs> okay, okay, I don't know, I don't know. Okay, let's just let's stick some other thing in there because we can. That's just the decoration that came. Oh, but you know that works. Hey now, hey hey. All right, that looks cool. That looks cool. Uh, gorgeous all right so you have that now let's see will it close will it close with those pins there oh yes you just have to press it down with it you have to because this is brand new so woohoo it's not heavy y'all i thought it was, was gonna feel very very heavy and it's not it actually still feels hmm, like maybe two and a half three pounds so it's not super heavy and then it looks like kind of like a binder. So, okay, I love this because I have my other um, folio and I have a few of these and I still love these and there's like a pen folio of this, but this looks like a binder on your shelf versus this that you're kind of can tell like, hey, is that a laptop thing up there? Um, and this looks like you put a book that's pretty i really like it here that. let's see maybe i want to magnet everything down or maybe i just want to slide that puppy in right there okay oh this is okay and 
I know some people do like some, maybe you want to stick a sticker book. Because there's a pocket back here. <laughs> oh, okay, I know. You, you know that I've l literally lost my mind already. So this is going to come in A5 and your 7x9s. So, uh, and there's personalizing available. There's going to be some base colors of black, slate blue, and dusty rose. Um, so this is the slate blue, which I'm super happy about. I love slate blue. Can I put this in backwards? Excitement. I, I cannot even see what I was doing. All right. So that looks gorgeous. That, that's everything. That's like, that's everything. That's, that's absolutely everything. I love you. I love you. I don't know what to say. It's <laughs> so pretty, but I really want to. Okay, I just need to find a reason to not minimize my lineup. I don't know what I'm thinking. Why? Why do I want to keep minimizing my lineup? I never minimize. I just I don't understand. I don't you know you just as much as I am right now, and I don't know what I want. Now you don't know what you want. None of us know what we want, so we're gonna buy it all, right? That's what we're gonna do. <laughs> Check out my links down in the description box below. Tell me what your favorite item was. Please discuss with me because I'm going to be on this trip for a while now trying to figure this out because what? All right. I, I think this is maybe my favorite collection from EC. I, I think it's my favorite year for Life Planner. I want to say that. I think I can generally say that now. Um, I still love the combination of the neutral palette with the Etta V thing. But maybe I could just do an A5 notebook there and not do a daily duel. I don't know. Because it's so fun. I don't know. Guys, help me out. Help me out, okay? Yeah.